from Boise City, Louisiana, and airing live here on Fight Network, LFA held their fourth installment on Friday night. The main event saw the featherweight title up for grabs with Kevin Aguilar taking on Damon Jackson. From the jump, Aguilar had Jackson's number repeatedly dropping him in the opening frame. The second round saw the UFC veteran and Jackson make a comeback of sorts, scoring with takedowns and briefly wobbling Aguilar. But in the third, the angel of death lived up to his name with an easy contender for knockout of the year. forward and low you know what when you drop your hand to throw a punch you telegraph something's coming you deserve to get hit like that just being very frank he telegraphed it all the way gave Aguiar a clean path right to his jaw his right leg folded up underneath him wow beautiful Yep, telegraphing punches will get you hurt in this game. With the victory, Kevin Aguilar not only claims the featherweight title, but also improves to 12 and 1. The co-feature saw the inaugural women's strawweight title on the line with Invicta FC veteran Andrea Lee taking on Heather Bassett. In the opening frame, KGB certainly got the better of the striking exchanges, possibly scoring a dominant 10-8 round. Bassett is certainly a gamer, however, bouncing back with some takedowns and big kicks in the second round. Coming into the third, Bassett had a nasty welt above her left eye, and Lee came out looking to finish. Close to securing a rear naked choke, Lee would shortly transition to a slick arm bar, getting the tap at 3 minutes and 40 seconds of the third round and becoming your new LFA Women's Strawweight Champion.